case you don't like Harry Potter or don't know about Harry Potter, in the books they talk about the spell called Loomis. Loomis um, turns on the light in the darkness. So if you're trapped in the dark, you just say Loomis and your wand lights up and yeah. And Loomis Maxima just makes everything brighter. Ugh. And I don't know if you know Tessa Netting, but she's like a hero to me. And um, her video, which I'll put in the description alone, talks about just how we need more Loomis in our lives. And a lot of people are going through a lot of things. And so am I. So is my best friend and my people I don't know. And so this is for you guys. Yes. Um. So I was thinking of how to do this and um how to start it. But I'm just gonna talk. Happiness can be found in even in the darkness of times if one only simply remembers to turn on the light. I know I didn't get that right, but in Harry Potter. Harry goes through a lot, and Expecto Patronum is good memories he had that drives away Dementors. <sighs> Yay, Harry Potter references. So in Harry Potter, there's Dementors, and Dementors basically suck on your soul. They make you sad and depressed, and recently I feel like Dementors were around me. Sure, they're in books, but I feel like it's suffocating me for this past year, and I feel like it's suffocating people and I want to know I want you to know if you're watching this and you feel alone and lost and scared you're not alone I promise as Darren says you're not alone you just look around there has to be one person that cares about you just that one and I think that's important to remember that one person or many people that are here for you and know that you're never alone a lot of people go through things. A lot of people go through things. Bad, good, whatever. And I don't know if this is like saying, hey, your day sucks. And if you feel like it lasts forever. And I don't know if it does because recently life has been really sucky. I don't know when it gets better and I don't know if it will get better, but I'm here. And that's saying something. I. I have depression and really bad anxiety and I had a panic attack today and my grandma died a year ago and things are just ugh, just and people have it worse and I know we're all selfish but I don't know I I just don't know so I got this book if you feel too much and in the book there's words but, um, I'm going to read this. I think it's my favorite. You're not alone in this. If yesterday was hard, one, you weren't the only one who felt that way. Maybe there are things you need to say. Maybe there's a letter you need to write and an email to send. Maybe it's going to take a long time, and today you just need to call a friend and begin to be honest. Maybe things are heavy or just too painful. Maybe it's time to sit across from a counselor for what it's worth I did for the first time last year and it helped me a ton. Maybe it's time to find some help. Help is real. Hope is real. These things are possible. You are not alone. The thing about the idea that you are not alone is that it doesn't do so much, do us much good if it's just an idea. We have to do something with it. It's like having no money and then someone hands you a check. You have to take it to the bank. Maybe you have maybe hope is like that. Maybe community is like that. Maybe relationships are like that. We have to choose these things. We have to say they're real and possible and important. We have to say some things out loud. We have to choose to believe that our stories matter along with the stories of the people we love. And I just felt like that, those passages hit me so hard. Like sometimes when you say to a person that's having trouble, you're not alone. Sometimes it doesn't help because you feel like they don't understand. And maybe people won't understand whatever you're going through. But there has to be at least someone 
someone who cares about you so much they would do anything for you and maybe you can't see him right now but you are loved you are beautiful and you are strong you're stronger than what people say maybe people say you're weak maybe people say you're a bitch or slut or whatever but you are not that you know who you truly are you're truly loved and amazing and beautiful and not alone in this world not anymore you have me you have tons of other people so please don't forget that i can tell you life is gonna suck and i don't know if it's gonna get better or worse but but it will get better, at least I hope. And hope is the greatest thing we have now, and so is love. So if we keep on believing, maybe things will change, and maybe it's hard to believe, because honestly, I've been there, I've done that. And sometimes I just don't care anymore. I just don't. And then, and then I put on my favorite song, or I read my favorite book, and I get messages from amazing people who care about me. And instantly I have something I have hope and sometimes you need to talk to people to help them through something even if you don't know them. look we may not know what to say to a person who needs help but we can be there and we can tell them that hey I know you're going through a rough time but you are loved and honestly people said that to me People are saying that to me, but if they said it in the beginning, it would help. I know parents and that are supposed to care about you, but they don't understand. They're your parents. But when someone else, a friend, a stranger who actually cares, who you know actually cares, it means the world. We're all lonely here. We have 7 billion people and we're all lonely. How weird is that? I never got that. But we're not alone. We will never be. I don't know what else to say in this video, because honestly, I don't know what to say to help you. But I'm going to put lists to suicide, um, places where you can talk, if there's someone to talk to. And I'll put um, a link to my Tumblr or Twitter, so you guys know that even if there's no one in your life that you can't talk to, I'm here, a stranger who cares about you. And I'm going through the same thing right now, and I don't love myself that much. And, you know, maybe we'll love ourselves eventually. It'll take time, but we'll get there. We're, we have each other. We'll get through this. And that, I can promise. Thanks for watching, guys, and I hope you have a really amazing day, and I hope it's better than mine. Um, so, catch you later. Bye.